Hello world, it's Almond Milk again, and I'm back with our first challenge video in the Pico CTF workout series. I'm thinking that we just basically, we can just go in order. Uh, it looks like the challenges are ordered by point values and by default, and obviously the lowest lower point challenges are going to be easier than the higher point challenges, so we might as well just go in order from least to greatest. As you can see on the left, I think I mentioned this in the last video, uh, there's different challenge categories, right? Web exploitation, cryptography, reverse engineering, forensics, journal skills, binary exploitation, and uncategorized. Well, we'll be diving into what each one of these categories are as we solve these challenges. You'll get familiar with what the challenge categories really, you know, break, like how these challenge categories break down and relate to cybersecurity as, as a whole. So let's start with obedient cat. And I have our, already have a feeling I know how to solve this one just based on the title, hone in like the cat word, right? Oh, they even have hints. Okay, interesting. So I guess if we get stuck, we can use these hints. And I don't think we'll need to use the hints until maybe like later on when the challenges get really rough. The description says, this file has a flag in plain sight, AKA in the clear. Let's go ahead and download the flag. Actually, wait, I'm gonna go ahead and do this on my Kali box because cat is a Linux command. You can always, a lot of times, challenge titles give away something about the actual challenge itself that'll, like it's it's in a hint within itself a lot of, sometimes. Sometimes it's not, sometimes it's just a red herring. But regardless, uh, I do believe that this challenge has something to do with the cat command as by the title. So I've already made a Pico do gem directory in here. So let's go ahead and make a obedient. Oops. Man, I cannot type right now. Good lord. All right. Okay, so as you can see, nothing in my directory yet. So let's go to challenge, download the flag. Let's see if we can't it this way did that work yeah okay so let's uh let's go ahead and take a look at the cat command just so you guys can get familiar with its context oh my gosh is it don't okay so the cat command just concatenates files to standard output. Basically, concatenate, when it says concatenating files to standard file, it's just taking what's in a file, like the contents of the file and printing it out to the screen, all right? So let's go ahead and clear our screen. ELS, cat flag, boom, there it is. Pretty straightforward, nothing too tricky here. You can also just, I mean, we can even go to Windows, right, and solve this here. So save file, and then uh, 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 literally you can just open it up in a text editor of any kind, and there it is. So pretty straightforward, nothing too difficult. So let's go ahead and, oh, well, I guess I could have just submitted it on the Linux box while I was over there, but we'll go ahead and just submit it here. Oops. Submit flag. Great. Hey, you have earned five points. All right, well, that wraps it up for this video. If you enjoy the content, please like and subscribe to the channel. These are these videos are a bit easier to make just because I'm freestyling it. Like I said in the, pre, in the intro video, I'm not scripting any of this really, except maybe the intro, maybe the outro if I decide to do one. But yeah, that's it for the first challenge. If, if you've made it through this far, you have five points, just like I do. I look forward to seeing you in the next video. Take care.